checking static pressure with the iManifold 921M manometer. What's up YouTube? This is going to be interrupted. Hello? In 4.8 miles. You're welcome, West thank you. Holly Springs Road. Right. That was my customer confirming the appointment, letting me know that she would be in the backyard and the house is open. So I have free reign. Anyway, um, I don't remember all the details, but I wanted to give you a little bit of a synopsis of what we're getting into on this call. I had been out for a maintenance checkup and the second floor system is not that old. I think it might be three, three and a half, four years old maybe. But um, they had had a new heat pump system put in for the second floor of the house. And when I did my tune-up maintenance, I noticed that the static across the return and the supply plenum was pretty high. If I remember anywhere near correctly, it was like 0.7 inches of water. So I pulled the pleated filtrate filter. Those are the worst filters for most applications. But I pulled the filter out and the return static dropped down, but then the supply static jumped and we still had high static and we, Based on the blower performance data, the static meant that the system was not pushing anywhere near the proper amount of air. I believe it's a two ton, and it was running maybe 500 CFM for a two ton system with the static where it was based on blower performance. So I recommended you know that we do some duct modification to try to reduce that static that they downgrade the filters so that the filter is not restricting airflow and uh, they've downgraded filters from what I've understood talking to them since then but they still have high static issues because of the inadequate supply but that's what we're getting into we're gonna do some um, duct change on the supply side to get that overall static down and uh, get their airflow where it should be for their system. So stay tuned and we'll dig into it here in a minute. All right, so as a bit of a preview here, we've got a 20 by 20 return grill and they've got a fairly cheap disposable filter in it. We've got one six inch supply in the bathroom we've got another six inch supply in what is a exercise and TV room we've got two in the master suite and so that makes a total of four so far and then we have a fifth in the spare bedroom gonna need to grab a ladder to get up in the scuttle hole up there cool on so we've got the new imperial i manifold static pressure meter here we're gonna go ahead and tie it to the return first and see what that return static is and then we'll uh, bring in the supply right now we're sitting at zero zero all right so we have a quarter inch of water on the return so we've got a 0.65 and you'll see my notes here if you can read it, um, that's what we had left it at at this point. We are on speed tap three at 230 volts, and we're not doing too bad, but that's a high static 
the registers are noisy and whatnot. So this is where we got it. 557 CFM out of a ton and a half at 0.7 which is where we're trending. We're trending a little closer to 0.7. We're 428 CFM. So we're gonna try to knock it down and try to get closer to the nominal 800. If we could get it down to 0.3, we'd have 785 CFM for this uh, to a ton and a half. Um, 557 really isn't bad, but what, what we're trying to improve here is the duct noise, register noise. So, we're going to play with that and see how that goes. I'm going to pull the two runs that go to the master bedroom off of the plenum and see how that changes our duct noise problems. As you can see, we dropped almost a tenth of an inch, if not a tenth of an inch, just by removing the two collars from the plenum. I'm gonna pull one more and see how that works. So at uh, 0.48.5, we're a little over the nominal ton and a half, 600 CFM. Um, 650. If we can lower the static and reduce the fan speed and get around a 0.4 static, then we'll be right there at about 607. Move across on 0.4. At speed tap 2, we're 607. Right now, we're in the vicinity of 6. 52 to 724 somewhere between there we were at 0.45 we have performance data at 0.4 and 0.5 not terrible we can do better one of the new features of the static pressure probe and the latest update to the i-manifold application is trending total external static. So right now we're running 0.47, half an inch basically. You can see that the line here, the blue dots are just at the top of the green range. So at five inches it moves into the yellow and it looks like just shy of 7.75 you get into the red the blower performance at half an inch on speed tap 3 is 652.5 follow that over to speed tap 3 and you've got 652 right there I'm gonna drop the fan speed down see if I can drop to 0.4 and get right there at the 607 which would be speed tap 2 at 0.4 inches alright as you can see we've got a steady 0 0.4, 0 0.41 and at 0.4 on speed tap 2 blower data says the system is running 607 CFM I'm satisfied with that, so we're going to leave it there. Wanted to thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this content, hit that like button, subscribe, comment, share it with one of your friends, and if you're able to and would like to support this channel to continue to make content like this, you can hit that blue support button below the video and make a contribution to help me keep making videos like this. We'll see you on the next video.